You guys are the brainchild of this entire thing of Salsa Fest. You did it the first time last year. Uh, talk to me a little bit about why you guys put this together. You know, we were sitting in a restaurant and we thought, you know, we should put some, like, just a street party, have some fun, bring the community together, have a free event. And we said, you know, there's, there's so much culture down here. And we choose our restaurants by the chips and salsa. I don't know about you guys. Um, but we said, why don't we do a, a salsa fest? And so we just kind of threw it together. Last year, we had about 1,500 to 2,000 attendees. We had 70 vendors. We're going to have more this year. We're going to have a two-day event. We're going to have, I think we have about over 50 vendors signed up so far. Yeah. You can still sign up. There's still time. And that's about all I got. Yeah, plenty of bands, right, too, Donnie? Oh, yeah. Um, that's the reason we did this. Another reason is we're, we're, I'm a musician. She's a big fan of music. She knows a lot of musicians. And we wanted to give them a place to show their abilities, their, their great, you know, music yeah. playing. And, and so that's what we did with the Salsa Fest. And uh, we couldn't do it without our great sponsors, Chris's Marine, yeah. uh, Towboat US, LNF Distributors, 97.5 KFTX. And uh, we also have like uh, 18 hours of live music, great bands, Splashes Brothers and Karen Lawrence and Tony Saracene also plan. Yeah, just a bunch of fantastic stuff going on. Downtown Renz is passed. It's like a massive block party, right? They have a, a, the road shut down. So again, Salsa Fest free event, Aransas Pass, Saturday and Sunday. You better be there. If you can excuse me, I'm uh, going to devour all this salsa now. Back to you.